why and how to properly apply succinic acid for plants, and what dosage is suitable for your indoor plants. Now you will learn the answers to these questions. You can often hear, I fertilize my flowers with succinic acid. This is a misunderstanding. Amber acid is not a fertilizer and its frequent use is undesirable. Why? Because it is a growth stimulant and over application can harm your green favorites instead of helping them in their time of need. How does succinic acid work? It greatly improves the absorption of all substances in the soil in addition to being a growth stimulant. It is also an anti-stress agent and stimulates root formation. Its effect depends on which part of the plant you treat. When watering growth and root health is improved, when spraying leaves and stems, the growth of green mass and young shoots is accelerated. Overall, its application affects the entire plant. Magic is not it. By the way, succinic acid itself does not contribute anything to the soil, but is used to stimulate the hidden reserves of a particular plant. Therefore, it is important to know the measure in order not to exhaust the plant in a short time. Everything is good in moderation and at the right time. Let us now consider what succinic acid can be used for. It can be used to soak seeds, tubers, bulbs to stimulate cuttings and improve root formation. It also stimulates the growth of young shoots to increase the immunity of plants during unfavorable periods, for example, in severe heat or cold after transplanting. As you can see, the range of application is quite wide, but I repeat, apply it only when necessary. Unsuccessful results may be due to improper use or the fact that the plant did not require it at the moment. For example, if the plant is already healthy, you won't see a meaningful effect because it produces a small amount of succinic acid on its own and increasing the concentration will not lead to improvement. In general, there is no magic button. To achieve good results, you should properly care for the plant and succinic acid will help to correct some deficiencies and mistakes. Another popular question is, why did the plant get worse after applying succinic acid? Again, the reason could be due to improper application. If the plant is attacked by pests, then using succinic acid can aggravate the problem by activating them. Therefore, you should first get rid of the pests and treat the plant before applying succinic acid to keep it healthy. And now about how to properly apply and dose succinic acid. For soaking seeds, dilute half a tablet in a liter of water and leave the seeds for 24 hours. For other cases, dilute one tablet per liter of water. You can water or spray the plants with this solution. It is better to start with a small amount of water and bring to the required volume after the tablet is completely dissolved. It is recommended to use succinic acid no more than once a month and only if necessary. Now you have all the necessary knowledge about succinic acid. Subscribe, give me a like, and stay tuned for more interesting videos. Your support means a lot to me.